It's problem number four on the long response, long answer portion of your test. And this asks us to use logarithmic differentiation to find the slope of the tangent line to this equation, y equals e to the 4x cosine x over the square root of 2x plus 4 at x equals 0. So logarithmic differentiation means that we're going to be taking the natural log of both sides. So we're going to take the ln of y is equal to the ln of e to the 4x cosine x over the square root of 2x plus 4. Now we're going to differentiate both sides, but first we can expand this to make these single um, logarithmic expressions instead of this combined one, and then that might make our differentiation a lot easier. So this is going to be equal to the ln of e to the 4x plus the ln cosine x, because remember going back to all your natural log um, properties, when we have a natural log of two things multiplied together, we add them when expanding, and then we're going to subtract when we divide. So minus um, the ln of 2x plus 4 to the 1 half. And remember, we can even bring that 1 half down to the front. So this is all equal to the ln of y. And so, and I can simplify this too. So this ln of e to the 4x, remember, you can bring that 4x to the front. And then ln of e is just 1. So this just gives us 4x ln of e, or 4x, yeah. So now that we have that, now we're going to differentiate. So the differentiation of ln of y is going to be y prime over y, which is equal to the derivative of 4x is just 4, plus the derivative of ln of cosine x is going to be 1 over cosine x times the derivative of cosine x, which is negative sine x, minus 1 half times ln of this, or times the derivative of ln of that, which is going to be 1 over 2x plus 4, times the derivative of the inside, which is 2. Um, and as you can see, we're going to be able to cancel those 2's out, and we get that y prime over y is equal to 4 minus sine x over cosine x is tangent x minus 1 over 2x plus 4. Alright, and remember we're just looking for y prime, so we're going to be able to multiply both sides by y, and remember our y is this whole huge equation e to the 4x cosine x over the square root of 2x plus 4. So, it looks a little bit scary now, but um, we're not done yet because we're looking to solve this. So I'm going to have to erase some of this work. So now I'm left with y prime is equal to 4 minus tangent x minus 1 over 2x plus 4 times e to the 4x cosine x over the square root of 2x plus 4. Alright, so that's what I'm left with. And I want to know y prime at x equals 0. So I'm going to plug in 0 for x. So that gives me 4 minus tangent of 0 minus 1 over 2 times 0 plus 4 times e to the 4 times 0 cosine of 0 all over the square root of 2 times 0 plus 4. Okay, so I'm going to go through and solve some of this because we know that tangent of 0 is 0. Um, so that will leave me over here with 4 minus 1 over 2 times 0 is 0 plus 4 is 1 fourth. Here, e to the 0 power, because 4 times 0 is 0, is going to be 1 times cosine of 0, which is also 1. So we have 1 over the square root 
of 4 because 2 times 0 is 0. We know the square root of 4 is in fact 2. So we have, and that's equal to y prime. So y prime then is equal to 4. We can rewrite that as um, 16 fourths minus 1 fourth is 15 fourths times 1 half. So that answer, and our final answer, will be 15 eighths. And that is problem number four for the long response.